Hello, friends of YouTube. Been a very long time since I've uploaded anything. I hope everybody had a good Thanksgiving and everyone is safe and, well, happy. <laughs> All things being equal. I hope everyone is healthy and well. And um, there's been a lot going on. That doesn't really say much, but um, there's been a lot going on. Positive, negative, and otherwise. And I just haven't felt like uploading. Just haven't had the emotional wherewithal to share anything about myself or just, I don't know. Sometimes I get tired of the sound of my own voice and sort of the bullshit up in my head. And um, But this video is kind of by request because um, Chris, my Canadian friend there, a foxy mess, said, why aren't we hearing from you? I want to hear from you. So I'm coming at you today with a huge holiday haul. Um, I went to the dollar store, Dollar General, you know, not the one where everything's a dollar, but like it starts at a dollar and, uh, it's raining like a mofu out there. So I went and did my laundry today and in between washing and drying loads, I went to the dollar store and Rite Aid and you wouldn't believe the stuff I got. Um, this is my daughter's first year in a house that they own. So I wanted to kind of go crazy with helping them decorate a little bit. Um, they're getting like a full size tree for the first time. And you know, the boys are two and four. So this is perfect for them to pick out stuff. And, um, she didn't have a lot of ornaments or anything. So I said, um, I don't want to overstep, you know, you might want to do your own thing, but if you'll let me be <laughs> your mom and, and Gigi grandma for a while, I'm going to go crazy spoiling you guys. So um, and I didn't break the bank because it's, you know, Rite Aid and Dollar Store. My hair, I got it professionally colored. And I don't know if it's just this light or what, but it looks really light gold here. And again, it just gets washed out. It's like $35 shampoo, a beta. But um, maybe I washed it too much because it was like really, really dark, rich, chocolatey, reddish brown. And now it's, it is what it is. Let's get started. I'm so excited. All right, so... In no particular order, here's some silver garland I got for their tree. Some balls, really kind of cool, nice design. Everything at Rite Aid was half price. Had to get her blue because she loves blue. They're very ornate. An L. A set of LED color changing wax Christmas trees for their mantle. Um, I got a Lint Classic Recipe pretzel chocolate bar because, you know, chocolate and pretzel. It might be for me. It might wind up going to someone else. These are Kit Kats for a co worker who loves Kit Kats. I want to surprise her with those. These tiny little battery-operated lights are from my crush over there, my little teddy bear nativity scene, which I'll show you later on. Um, I've got my miniature tree up today. It's real, but it's only two and a half. Eh, it might be three feet tall. So I've got 50 mini lights for that. I got two wax melts, um, holiday spice, and dusted pine, because I've got two wax melts burners going on at any given time. This is fun to dig in and show you guys because I haven't looked at anything since I bought it. Uh, hang on a minute. Here's some ceiling, ceiling action for you. Whoops. Well, this was bound to happen. Oh, I love when things get fucking stuck. I, that shouldn't be bothering me as much as it is, but it is, so. Fangu. Bafanopoly. <sighs> All right. What was I? A jingle bell for one of their doorknobs. This garland's for me. It's white and silvery. It reminds me of snow. I got some wrapping paper. 
with a really pretty tree design. I love this a lot. Kind of classic. Um, these guys light up. They're for my grandchildren. I got a little uh, snowman and then another one. I'm going to run out of room here. Here's the other one. Watch how cute this is. It lights up in all different colors. That's right. I did get two snowmen. So that they wouldn't fight over them. Just so cute. And then... I got them window stickers. Holiday hedgehogs and more of a classic Christmas scene. For them to decorate their windows. I got two of these... For my outside banisters that I'm going to put like scotch pine roping around and then decorate with big red bows. Because I can't really do a lot outside of my cottage. There's no electricity out there. Um, there's really no trees around me to hang anything from. So I just kind of do what I can with like the front steps. And uh, my little baby Christmas tree is on the porch. Got a really pretty simple box that I'm going to put toffee in. I make Christmas cracker you know, saltine cracker toffee every year. So I got some tins and some pretty boxes. Here's another one of those bows. This stuff is really going to start to accumulate. And then along the side of the banisters is going to be this. Uh, I got four of these. Two on each side. Red and gold bows. So we don't... I don't need to individually show all of those. I have to work tonight. Hang on a minute. Let me just get my bearings here. I thought this was really cute. The kids are going to get a kick out of it. It's a Santa that you hang up and then you can count down the days to Christmas by moving this um, candy cane. I think that's just super cute. Some more garland to send her. Some matchbox cars for the kids' stockings. I am sweating my ass off in here. I still get really bad hot flashes, you guys. Five years into menopause. It's bad, y'all. What's the other... Uh, look at this turkey skin right here. I use very expensive Clarins. Clarins cream on my neck and decollete. And it still looks like a dinosaur. This is ridiculously cute. It's a boxing Rudolph. Kind of weird, but the boys will love playing with that. Buck 99. At the Dollar General. Moving right along. Oh, that's a birthday card for my aunt. Here is a whale glitter ornament. Because the boys love sea creatures. Let's just bring this bag up here, shall we? A dinosaur, like a pterodactyl ornament. A gingerbread man. A brontosaurus with a Santa hat. Pretty much the cutest thing I've ever seen. I said that a lot today, actually. This may or may not wind up being on my tree. A pink glitter unicorn. A little owl guy. That's going to go to my daughter, too. I'll have to sort all this out after. Um, What else? Just keep going. There's a lot. This might have to be in two parts. 
Here's a, um, uh, a sequin, you know, one of those changeable. I've always wanted to get them, get one of these for the boys, but not just as a pillow. This is a narwhal. I just think it's so cute. This was like $4 at Rite Aid. I got the boys candy canes to hang on their tree. Pardon me while I fix my bra strap. I hate when it falls down. I got them each a nutcracker, which I hope they won't, they'll, you know, I hope my daughter explains to them it's not really a toy. It's more of like a decoration for their mantle. I am hooking them up another boxing Rudolph oh no his oh there we go I got myself a Santa hat with sequin glitters to wear to work I think my clients my residents will get a big kick out of me wearing a Santa hat to work So, in health news, the last time I spoke to you guys, I had had my angiogram, I had had my uretoscopy, I've had my lithotripsy, went back for a follow-up, my kidneys look good, but now I have some kind of a brachioplexy, I've got some kind of a, um, a nerve infection in my hand, this hand is all numb and tingly and really sore, like all along the side of it, and my, my pinky keeps on like curling in. And I can't really feel this hand very much. So I've got some kind of a nerve issue going on. So back to the doctor I go on Thursday. And I had to switch shifts, you know, to make room for that. But at least I was able to. I thought this ornament was very unique. Kind of Asian inspired. I don't know. It's, it's just very cool to me. So I'm going to give that to my daughter. I almost feel like keeping it, but... Here is another nutcracker. You know, for Dollar Store, they're pretty damn good quality. I mean, this guy is kind of heavy. They don't feel that cheap. This was $3.99. They had big ones, too. This is for my daughter, because she loves anything with stars. And it's, like, very stylized. more stars on like fuchsia balls I like unusual colors for Christmas not just red and green I love actually blues and fuchsias and violets and whatnot and is that it for this bag no I got earrings for my aunt don't hate because it's dollar store she won't know but she loves butterflies and these are actually very Victorian looking very cute. $2.99. How can you go wrong? I'll put them in a, a regular jewelry box. And a little angel ornament with my youngest grandson's name on it. Which I was very pleased to find. Okay, moving along. Back to Rite Aid. Some really attractive, um, kind of ornate looking to and from labels. Sugar cookie candles that were only $6 each. And they smell just as highly scented as Yankee Candle or Bath and Body Works, for real. The brand is Seasonal Scents. And it's sugar cookies. I got two because I am so all about the baking smell and like vanilla smells when it comes to candles. So I got two of those. I'm at 14 minutes. Holy shit. Okay. The boys are completely into Hot Wheels. Totally. And I found them a Hot Wheels like a gingerbread house. Only it's a garage. I don't know if I want to give them this before Christmas or for Christmas, 
that it would make for a great project because, you know, they're housebound. Well, they're not housebound, but you know what I mean. They don't do play dates and stuff. Tins for the toffee I always make. Boob cam. I like this one. I like all of them. This one's cute. Toys and teddy bears and whatnot. Is that it? Maybe that is it. That's enough. All right, guys. There's not really much else to talk about. I mean, work. I'm back in AA. Uh, just getting after the health issues and <coughs> working hard. And uh, I don't feel like talking about anything else, quite frankly. I don't feel like getting into any drama, you know, um, there was some drama on Thanksgiving. There was some drama the day before Thanksgiving involving family members. And, uh, I keep my circle small and tight for a reason. I'm just too, I'm too raw inside from all the different things over the years. And, you know, I'm getting older and I just want to like work because I have to, and then be home with my cats and my music and internet and food and books and poetry and music and that's about it I'm exhausted I'm going to take a nap because I'm working tonight and it was nice to visit with you all thanks for taking part of my in my holiday haul and I'll talk to you guys later alright I promise to try to upload more because some of you actually watch me thanks for prompting me to do this Chris and uh, I gotta catch up with your videos as well uh, when I don't get a chance to, it doesn't mean I don't care. It just means I'm very involved with my own life and shit going on. We can all say that, right? Okay. Peace out. Happy holidays, everyone. Stay safe. See you later.